Welcome to Chop Talk Tutorials. You are watching Farman Khan, and I am again here with a new video. And the topic is lipids. The first question is, what are lipids? The any class of organic compound that are fatty acids or their derivatives are known as lipids. They are insoluble in water and soluble in organic solvents. They contain carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, phosphorus, nitrogen, sulfur in their structures. Carbon, hydrogen and oxygen do not present in 1 is to 2 is to 1 ratio as in carbohydrates. In may carbon, hydrogen and oxygen ka ratio 1 is to 2 is to 1 nahi hota. They include waxes, oils, steroids etc. Now we will discuss the structure of lipids and the monomers of lipids that are fatty acid and glycerol. We have two monomer units of lipids that is fatty acid and glycerol. So fatty acid it is a long chain of carbon contains carboxyl group at one end. A long chain of carbon that may contains carbon vary from 1 to 19 in number and at one end it contains a polar hydrophilic group that is a carboxylic acid group. This is known as a fatty acid. This polar head of fatty acid is hydrophilic in nature while the non-polar tail is hydrophobic in nature. Now for the glycerol. Glycerol is a long chain alcohol that contains three carbons and three OH groups. This is glycerol. Basically, it contains three OH groups. These OH groups are replaced by fatty acids, and on the basis of number of fatty acids present in glycerol, it may be considered as monoglyceride, diglyceride, and triglyceride. If only one fatty acid is placed here, then it is called as monoglyceride. Monoglyceride. If two fatty acids are present then it called diglyceride and if three fatty acids are present here then it called as triglyceride triglyceride now we will discuss the classification of lipids and their functions Basically, lipids can be classified into simple lipids, compound and derived lipids. The simple lipids contain only fatty acid and glycerol. Compound lipids contain fatty acid glycerol plus phosphorus, nitrogen or sulfur in their structures. Derived lipids, they are the simply the derived form of compound and simple lipids. The steroids, covexis, carotenoid. Simple lipids contains fatty acid. The fatty acids that on the basis of bond, on the basis of type of bond, they may be saturated or unsaturated. Saturated fatty acid contain only single bonds in their structure, while unsaturated fatty acid contain double or triple bond in their structure. Example is waxes. Now compound lipids. They may further classified into glycoproteins, lipoproteins, and phospholipids. Derived lipids that is steroids that are made up of four interlocking chains of carbon and example is cholesterol. Now wax is long chain alcohol plus ketone. This long chain of alcohol is other than glycerol. This long chain of alcohol is not glycerol. Now carotenoid example is carotene and made up of liquid pigment plus two to six carbon rings. Now we will discuss the role of lipids in body components and other functions. The role of lipids. High energy source, they are considered to as high energy source, source, example oil, they are the components of cell membrane, that is the cell membrane contains uh, amount of lipids, that is phospholipids, heat insulators, they also act as heat insulators and they most important work is waterproofing of feathers, waterproofing in case of aquatic animals, they act as waterproofing agents, they are the precursor of sex hormones. Handwritten notes are available for this topic. Uske liye aapko is video pe comment karna padega. Then I will provide you the link for handwritten notes. And friends, please like, share and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.